Hey, welcome to this Windows channel and today is a little test that I've done and it's nothing scientific, really nothing scientific. I just um, wanted to see the different browsers, compare the different browsers, the most popular ones, and see how they compare with Microsoft Edge, the new browser from Microsoft. So I tested Internet Explorer 11 um, with all the pages including the start page that I've chosen which is tarot.com so all browsers were tested from complete stop to show me the start page first of all and then from that page going to different pages on the web that I've chosen um, I've actually checked four pages so Internet Explorer 11 Microsoft Edge, Google Chrome that I've checked also, and finally Mozilla Firefox. And the reason I chose um, these three compared to Edge, uh, IE 11, Chrome, and Firefox, is because they make out probably 99% of all the browsers that surf the web. And that one percent that's left is the you know uh, very small percentage of probably what's um, Safari and um, other browsers from you know Linux and so on uh, that could be used. But uh, these are the three most popular browsers. And so, um, like I said, nothing scientific. But here's the little numbers: loading time to start page. Once again, the start page is therot.com. So I shut down the computer and then I restarted the computer and from scratch, from start, I've loaded the start page of every browser which is therot.com and the numbers are in fastest browser Google Chrome from start to start page. So from really the basic zero to start page 5.18 seconds that's pretty fast second Microsoft Edge 7.96 seconds in third place was Internet Explorer 11 at 8.35 seconds and finally the last Mozilla Firefox at 10.62 seconds so fastest browser is Google Chrome from start to my tarot.com start page and Microsoft Edge second but uh, quite close to Internet Explorer 11 as you see. Uh, my Mozilla Firefox is the slowest but I'm not surprised last time I did a test to load pages on web browsers Firefox was one of the slowest um, I think they need to work around that and try to make something a little more a little faster I think Firefox needs to be uh, maybe uh, you know have a good update where they're gonna fix a lot of things it's become a little heavy with time uh, and um, it shows here again so uh, big big winner Google Chrome but uh, second is Microsoft Edge third IE 11 and finally Firefox then from there I decided I'd load computerworld.com computerworld.com is this page this is one of the spots that I sometimes go read news for um, you know all sorts of news on PCs and technology so going from my start page my own page to the computerworld.com very heavy page because it's a big page it has a lot of features uses a lot of technologies that's why I chose it the big big winner once again Google Chrome 7.22 seconds Google Chrome is actually very fast and uh, this is the latest version of Google Chrome which is I believe Google Chrome version 42 and um, 7.22 seconds that's not bad at all in second place once again Microsoft Edge at 8.85 seconds third place Internet Explorer 11 at 10.12 seconds and finally Mozilla Firefox once again last at 12.45 seconds so we see that the clear winner is still Chrome 
And you know what? I think it does show that even though my little uh, test here is not scientific, it, it has a, you know, sort of a, a tendency that you can see where it's going at that's pretty clear um, most of the time. So uh, big winner, Google Chrome, but second is Microsoft Edge. So Microsoft Edge is actually not that bad. Tenet Explorer 11 third and Mozilla Firefox last at 12.45. Then I went to load CNET.com. CNET.com is this page. This is CNET.com. And thanks to uh, the page to have exactly the same amount because one of the biggest problems in testing unofficially like this loading pages is the fact that uh, very often you know have different ads different types of uh, there are different things that, that appear every time you load but uh, in cnet.com was which was nice is that that my windows 10 ad is the only ad that was at the top and always there and always was the one showing up so all of the tests going to cnet.com are exactly the same pretty much on the web page that it showed so where we are at here is for this page cnet.com which in what's interesting is microsoft edge actually was the fastest browser at 6.65 seconds that's interesting second was internet explorer 11 at 8.18 google chrome turned on this one at 8.63 and mozilla firefox once again last at 13 that 25 seconds and you know I waited that 13 seconds is when I clicked and I waited for this Windows 10 um, ad to show up here at the top so that's when I stopped the stopwatch when I was actually checking the pages so uh, in this one clear winner Microsoft Edge so you see that at this third page Edge is first but it was second in the other one so it shows that Edge is actually a fast browser and uh, that's very interesting to see so Edge number one IE11 number two Google Chrome number three and Mozilla Firefox number four and last but not least I chose to load a local uh, newspaper page that is always uh, uh, you know one of the pages that's near me and also it's one of the pages that uh, has a lot of stuff on it to show and this is the page that I loaded this is a local newspaper we have here so what do we have in our speed tests Google Chrome came first mm, Internet Explorer second in this one Firefox was third and Microsoft Edge was last but look at how close this is they're all in four seconds so this one I'm not really counting that it's very accurate because when it's too close you know the time that I start and stop the stopwatch and so on is uh, probably you know there's part of an error here you know when it's a, a few seconds well now you know that you probably have a number that's not bad that's pretty good but when it's so close let's just count they're pretty much equal on this one I'm not gonna name a winner here I'm gonna say that all four did really well in that uh, page that I loaded so once again nothing scientific nothing official I did not use any software I just you know counted how long it took to load pages to start up and so on but this is the these are the numbers that I've got so clearly uh, we know that Google Chrome is the big winner but we also see that Microsoft Edge is uh, a pretty good second so Microsoft Edge is not that bad at all and uh, I think it's gonna be an interesting browser to check as time goes by um, and if you're wondering what browser I'm using um, I actually used a lot Microsoft Edge and Windows 10 but I still use Google Chrome for a simple reason uh, it's because I have multiple Google accounts and they all sync with Google Chrome very well so that's why I use Chrome basically but um, you know what if it wouldn't wouldn't be for that sync capability uh, Microsoft Edge would probably be the browser I'd be using now um, I really like the browser so I uh, hope you enjoyed this unofficial test 
and um, it's going to be interesting to see. I'll try to uh, probably do a bigger test and uh, when Windows 10 is officially out I'll uh, find a way to do a, a more scientific test if you want so um, so that's interesting. If you enjoy my videos why not subscribe to our channel you'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments, questions, anything you want to know, any comments you might have about this test or anything else uh, or your impressions maybe you have your own impressions of browsers as you've tried uh, why not share it with us in the comments it's always nice to have your feedback. So thank you for watching.